Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to Faster Than Light. I'm Cole, gonna be your captain today. And let's just start a new game. Uh, let's rename our ship. That's the name the game gives you every time. We're gonna be the USS. Uh. Not going to die. Oh, come on. Okay, we're not going to do that. USS Vulnerable, because that's pretty much what we are. This game is extremely hard. Okay. That, sh that should do it. Let's see what we got down here. Just a bunch of humans. You're actually going to be the captain of our ship, Will. Congratulations, you've just been promoted. Uh, everything looks in order. Playing on normal. I have not unlocked Type B to unlock that. Need to do these achievements, and they are insanely hard. Alright. The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll need supplies for your journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before the pursuing rebel fleet can catch up. And there's a tip. That's. Uh, we already know. Cool. Now, this game is pretty com it looks pretty complicated at first, but it's actually fairly easy. Uh, first let's... Maloney, you're gonna be our engines, and Cremity, or Cremity, I'm not even sure. You're gonna be our weapons guy. I hope, I'd, maybe you're a guy. Alright, we need a captain, Cole, you're gonna be our captain for today. Congratulations, man. These are our power bars, you can get them by upgrading your ship right here, and you can also upgrade pretty much everything else. Uh, except your crew, I mean, you can dismiss them, but who would want to do that? Right now I don't have enough power to run everything, so I'm gonna take off the med bay, because no one's using that right now, and power straight to the engines, so that way we have a 20% evade. And let me just tell you, tell you straight off the bat, this game is hard, like, you don't even know. Well, you're about to find out. It's turn-based and real-time, because right here is the turn-based part, where you move, and then somewhere over here is a rebel fleet. Just every time you move, they move. But then, you, say, you see, combat is uh, real-time. You have to fire your missiles and stuff. Uh, despite the barren area, a trader has set up a shop. Alright, sweet. Um, fuel for five missiles? I think that's a solid trade right now. Let's go over here and check what's out. Check, see what's over here. Alright, here we go. Got some combat for you. Once you arrive, your screen lights up with warnings. A nearby pirate seems to have advanced hacking tools and they've tried to shut down our engines. Your crew manages to keep them barely operational and you move into attack. Alright, let me just pause the game to uh, kind of explain to you how this is going to work. These are our weapons right here. A burst laser is going to fire. I think it fires uh, three lasers. That's going to hit. One's going to hit the shield, break the shield, because they only have one. And then the other two are going to hit. Hopefully, if they don't have good evade. Otherwise, you're going to miss a lot of shots. Artemis can bypass the shield, so it'll go right through it. Um, the only time I really need that, needed to use an Artemis, is if they have maybe two or three shields, or I'm in a pretty tight spot. But for this, we're, you can actually choose and fire like that while you're in the pause menu, which is really useful if you're in like battle and everything's getting really hectic you can pause just take a minute to look and just all right right now we're locked it takes a couple seconds um, to lock on and once it locks on it'll fire you can actually set it to auto fire which I think we'll do there you go we got hit for a couple hull damage there and you repair hull damage at the shops and if, yeah you drop zero the ship is destroyed or if all your crew members die it'll be destroyed and you see, they barely have anything. That's mo mainly because we're a federate. We're part of the federation, and they're only a scout. You'll often find scouts that don't even have any people in it. So, for instance, targeting oxygen would just be a bad idea. But right now, we're going to focus on weaponry because if they don't have weapons, they can't hit us. See, we didn't take hardly any damage there, and we got 12 scrap and three fuel. All right. Every time you jump to a new place, it takes away one fuel. If you run out of fuel, bad news bears, guys. It's not good at all. And, uh, well, scrap. You can use that to upgrade your ship, which I'm going to do right now. 
so now we can run everything at one time and you can also use it to buy stuff at stores and we have a distress call we can go check that out see what's going on you arrive at a distress beacon near a small asteroid belt and find a ship with pirate markings partially crushed between two large rocks. It must have been illegally mining the belt without proper equipment. Um, I think I'm going to destroy and loot the ship because pirate. They attack me all the time. I hate them. And we got a decent amount of scrap, a couple missiles, and a fuel. And for no cost to us. Here is the rebel fleet. If we go in there... Not good, guys. It's in extremely hard to beat the people in there. So we're just going to keep on moving. Going to have to go through this nebula, which will just destroy our sensors. Just very bad. A rebel ship has been patrolling this region. As soon as you arrive, it begins its assault. So I'm going to take... All right. They have a teleporter. So we're going to do this and then use an Artemis to fire at their teleporter. Hopefully they won't make it on board. This will actually send some of their crew members onto our ship. And yeah, we got some. They're trying to hurt our doors. So who don't we need? Um, Cole, I think you can go take this guy. Let's see if he'll find us in the med bay. Is he gonna... No, he's just gonna keep attacking that. Alright, whatever. And they've hit the med bay. So that means bad things are gonna happen. Come on, Cole. You got this. Oh, I know he needs the med. Go fix the med bay. Jeez. Enemy ship is powering up its F faster than light. Um. You know what? We will not accept surrender. Take an Artemis right to their engine so they can't leave. Burst lasers continue. Alright, cool. And it looks like he destroyed our doors. Wow. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna be really mean. What? How can I do this? Oh, our doors are shut down. Oh. Pfft. Well, we can't do that. I was gonna just deprive him of oxygen, but his ship is destroyed. So now we just need to take care of him. And he's gonna be loyal to his ship and stay there. Our shields are critical. Get in there, man. Come on, Maloney. Colt, help her out. To him, actually. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right. So it appears everyone seems to be all right. You're gonna go fix the doors. Who's that? Cole? No, you're not a shields guy. Heal yourself up real quick. Get in there. And the doors are good. Man, that's good. It's good. We're doing pretty good so far jump straight into this nebula yeah with the nebula we won't be able to oh we get to trade some missiles for nope don't have a drone see it messes up our sensors we won't be able to know what's going on in our ship so we're just gonna not even mess around in there cuz I don't like nebulas all right we intervene to defend oh crap again all right our doors so hopefully he's gonna he went for the doors. Alright, whatever. We're gonna basically mm, stop him from breathing. Well, we're not even firing. What am I doing? Straight to the shields. Oh, wow. Our sensors are gone. That was bad. Alright. We know he's in the doors. Wow. This is gonna... That means I can't close the doors. And since there's no oxygen in there. Not good. I hope he's still in there. Where is he? He's in the med bay. Alright, at least Malone will... Alright, I'm trusting you to take him out. I'll focus on this battle. I think we're about to kill him anyway. Actually, I don't need to waste my... Those. Oh, Kremini, come on. Go fix the med bay. Alright, they're dead. But this guy's still in here. Go kill him. How am I going to get the doors operational? Go fix the doors. Wow, there's no air in there whatsoever. Wow, we're in a sticky situation here, guys. 
Ja. Uh, hmm. Go heal yourself up. Who are you? You're the... She's the weapons guy. I'm gonna have to... You're gonna go fix the doors, okay, mate? Okay, you're good. It's a very strategic game. You gotta know when to upgrade your ship. I kinda wanna upgrade doors. Sensors, actually. Sensors are cool there. Oh, crap. Alright, we got doors online. Sweet. Close all the doors so oxygen can return to the ship. And oxygen will spread faster if you have all the doors open. Especially near the oxygen thing. Yep. Not really. I don't really know how well it's going. Oh, it's going quite well. I actually need to go fix the sensors before we jump away. Uh, let's get two guys in on this so we can go through this pretty quickly. Our sensors are back online. Hooray. Sweet. Let's go fight somebody else. Discover nearby planet speckled with settlements, although none respond to your hails. Wow. Wasted some. A store. Sweet. Uh, let's see what they got at this store. Pond, greeting, you see a message from a nearby ship. Greetings and welcome to our beacon for a small fee. I'll let you continue on your way. Yeah. We're just gonna kill them. Because we're awesome. We can do that. Artemis to the shields. Actually, Artemis to the oxygen. We're gonna be mean. <laughs> do I have everybody on the right place? Yeah, we do. Cool. Oh. They're they're on fire. That's good news for us. We're actually gonna fire on this now. And take this off. Okay. Never mind. Killed him. Alright, cool. That was extremely easy. I thought we got to the store, but I guess there is no store there now. I'm just gonna show you guys some cool stuff they had. Hmm. The ship. Stay out of this or you'll be next. Concentrate fire on. Attack the pirate! Because we're the good guys in this game. And they have a combat drone, which attacks your ship and is very bad. So we're going to take that out fairly early on and throw that right at their weapon system. See what watch, it'll take out will it take out our shields? It won't. But as you can see, that's now worthless. So throw one of those right there. They do have a what's it called a system repair drone. They're trying to escape. Oh, they're not escaping on my watch. So we're just gonna do that. Oh no. Their FTL is charging. Uh, we can have enough time. Just don't miss. Yep. Got their engine. And we got a lot of stuff. What the pirates got on the signal station? Uh, you got. You signal the station. We appreciate what you've done, but there'll just be another ship looking to profit from our isolation soon enough. Sorry we can't give you more. Nah, that's alright. Yeah, we got enough stuff. We're gonna go here, and then exit, and the next us, next sector will be tomorrow's video. Uh, these are some mercenaries. I don't really have need of their services, but I kinda wanna fight them, just cause it's fun. Mercenaries are worse than rebels. The only honorable course is to engage the mercenary in battle. And looks like they have a pretty standard ship. Uh, not that much health, so we're gonna attack the weapons and the oxygen, because I just feel like being mean today. Unless they're being mean to innocent people, then I will intervene. Oh, this is a slug interceptor. Slugs are actually an alien race on this world of faster than light. There's uh, a lot of different races. I think there's like six or seven, I think. 
Uh, you got your normal humans, and then there's these Zoltons, which actually give you energy to your ship. And these guys are NGs in there. They're like half human, half robot. So they do pretty well with repairing, I think. And you have, like, bug insect things. Alright, this is exit. You usually don't get a fight on the exit, but I've, I've had it happen before. Uh, you see, uh, we can trade some... Oh yeah, definitely, because we don't have a drone yet, so we don't even need that. Um, here's how this works. You're here, and you have to make it all the way to the um, your Federation base, but all the way over here, and fight the boss. If you can do all that, you win the game. I've never actually won the game before. And we're going to take the civilian sector, and... I think this is going to be for tomorrow's video, guys. Um, I'm going to go to the main menu now. Oh, wait. Never mind. I will guess I'll save and quit after I talk to you guys. Um, so if you're interested in Fast and Light and want me to keep doing videos, just post in the comments telling me that you enjoyed it. If you want some more papers, please, so I can keep doing that. Uh, another video will probably be out tomorrow or the day after that definitely doing another faster than light tomorrow because I'm really enjoying this game uh, a like would be nice yeah but it's your choice really you can do it everyone just enjoy my free entertainment I'll see you guys tomorrow hopefully you guys have a nice day